are you watching this impeachment stuff? Yeah, like I'm happy you about it. You watch on Twitter, impeachment. like for a couple of minutes, and then I just log in. You know, it's like on. eight hours. Yeah, so I watch like a couple of minutes. Yeah. So sometimes it pops up, and I click on it, and you're like, like right. you guys have such short attention spans. Yeah, yeah generation. It's terrible. Are you following it at all? Are you I watching am. the hearings? I actually watched all first I, two I, days of it. How were you doing it when you were at work? <laughs> yeah, I gotta say, I did not. Why? Holler at me when he's out of here, right? I don't want to hear anything else about it. That's kind of how I feel. So the best thing is like you're spilling wine on yeah, yourself so and you're like, tell me he's out of here. This is my third or fourth, by the way. Have you been watching the impeachment hearings at all? I've watched it. I think they're just doing it for media, for show. Yeah. But I don't believe mouth. nothing that man says. Yeah, I don't know. It's just convincing. <laughs> I love him. You do? Yes, I love him. You love Donald Trump? Love him. You understand the word? L O V E. Oh, okay. I get it. I'm just I surprised. Yeah. Yeah. Why, why'd you be surprised? There is a narrative out there, and you know this, that Donald Trump is a racist. And that's bullshit. If I look at anything, the Democrats are racist. What have they ever done for black people? Here's the thing. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think Donald Trump is racist. Why not? I just think he's an asshole. Trump's a racist bastard, but he's not a Nazi. The last time I visited my mom, she threw me out of the house because I basically went off on her supporting Trump. I said, he's a Nazi and you're supporting him. You basically called her a Nazi. Well, when the shoe fits. Your mom's a Nazi. Listen, I said she's supporting a Nazi. Okay. That's what I said. But by the way, just for the record, it's awful. the people who supported Hitler, they were Nazis. Yeah. It's the white corporate press. 95% of all publications, news, everything else owned by five companies. So they can make you think anything they want you to think. You just break this down for me. So I can be, I can be white accurate. Corporate. Yeah, be no. Accurate. I'm white corporate press, man. I finish what I'm saying. The point comes out. I didn't interrupt to, you. No, I, I know. I'm <laughs> yeah. sorry, but you were yeah. gonna say yeah. something. That's no, I'm thinking. So you're like fully getting your news from me. Well, when I go down through the source, like, okay, where did, where did this come from, the Times or whatever, and then I'm like, oh. you're not getting to the Times, you're getting your memes. So you don't Snapchat your memes on your phone? Snapchat, what am I, fucking 12? You don't send them to <laughs> your friends? No, no. Your life is not exciting, man. And so what happens if it's Elizabeth Warren versus Trump? How do you feel about a woman in office? Well, it's not like 1840. I mean, like, I'm fine with it. He yeah. said it's not like 1840. Yeah, I'm, not, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> I'm good. I'm I, really, I think a female should That's run it. this country. Yeah, no, it would be great. Well, the right one would be great. Like, I have, like, ex-girlfriends that I would not want running the country. Oh, no, no, no. I got some baby moms like, I wouldn't want to run either. Nobody in Ohio is voting Elizabeth Warren. Trump set a standard. Before, you know, you had Obama up in the podium giving a proper speech, like you know. Told. Now, he just rolled out of bed, seriously, and just got on Twitter. Like, this is like, today's yo, news. Yeah, we grabbing women by the pussy. Like, <laughs> I think you're completely batshit the same. And I hope that you never <laughs> yes. get even close to the levers of power. Right. <laughs> Thank you very much for that. Cheers to that. Yeah. Thanks.